Microsoft Recall is being forced onto all Windows 11 computers, starting with the release of Windows 11 24H2. Microsoft now wants it to be mandatory that Windows 11 computers have Recall enabled by default, what's worse is that Microsoft is planning on removing the ability to disable or uninstall Recall, meaning it will be deeply baked into our Windows 11 machines, this is extremely concerning as I'm someone who votes for freedom and liberty and privacy as well, so when a tech giant like Microsoft wants you to have zero privacy, what you see is what you get with Microsoft, there is no expectation of privacy today, and as Mark Zuckerberg once said, privacy is no longer a social norm, which holds true to this very day because each and every day, we lose more of our privacy and control over our data, instead, that power and control goes to tech giants and governments which raises serious concern about how they handle user data. We know that the government spies on its citizens and uses extensive, powerful technologies to monitor and censor a population. It only took a whistleblower like Edward Snowden for the world to realize that we are living under oppressive regimes with tight and strict controls over access to information, and no amount of switching to Linux is going to free you from your government surveillance state. Sure, Linux doesn't collect, store and sell personal information about you or your system, but it does not make you invisible to prying eyes. Even Tails OS, one of the most private OSs on planet Earth, won't protect you from surveillance, despite the distro's pro-privacy aspects like MAC address randomization, being configured to run over the Tawar network, which is an anonymous network ran by thousands of volunteers worldwide and an inability to retain a user's session due to the amnesic nature of Tails OS, still is not enough to prevent yourself from being monitored, and potentially sold for a profit. Remember, user data is very valuable today because of companies like Google and Microsoft, who constantly share our data with third parties and data brokers, both of which make a living off of user data, so the fact that Microsoft wants to strip you of all your freedoms, privacy, and autonomy is very worrying to say the least, and even if you don't want to switch to Linux, or straight up don't care about any alternatives, you should not be ignorant of the fact that surveillance is a weapon which can be used against you in a court of law, it always has been, always is, always will be there for that reason, and recall is basically taking things a step further, invading the home user's life to sneakily take screenshots every 5 seconds to see exactly what you're doing and even what you're looking at, and I seriously do not want Microsoft knowing what I do on my system, we should all have our own fucking rights to privacy, it's like when you go to the toilet, do you leave the door open, or do you close it when you're doing your business, of course you fucking close the door, why on earth would you let people see your you know what's when you're doing your business, see how it's not appropriate, well if you can think of Microsoft Recall as being like someone who's invading your personal space, that's exactly what Recall is, someone, or something rather, that interferes with one's life, Recall is a fucking joke, this feature desperately needs to be recalled, Microsoft, go back to square one you dumb cunts, and try to think of a way which Recall can be used only for positive purposes, because the way I see it, Recall is going to be a weapon of its own disguise. It will be used to sentence people to prison for crimes they did not do, or really minor trivial crimes like pirating software. It can also be a way for the cops to keep tabs on you, so every screenshot that goes back to Microsoft, the cops also get a copy of it. Each and every screenshot will be in the hands of your police. You just gotta hope the cops are not so stupid that they'll come and arrest your ass for literally anything you've just done with your new Windows 11 computer, but given police can be very incompetent and corrupt, and they don't care about morals or ethics, it's very likely that recall will also be a weapon for police forces to silence people they don't like, or strike up extend upon police corruption and perverting the course of justice to further empower themselves to retain full power over the population. Recall is bad in so many more ways than one, I cannot possibly explain it all in one video, but from what I have seen, others do not want this recall feature either. The only people who can benefit from recall are rich bastards who are quite literally above the law, or, law enforcement and military groups. 
These are literally the only people who will be taking advantage of Microsoft Recall, and they won't to be using it to catch the criminals, no, they will use it as a way to make up evidence for a case where evidence is absent, absence of evidence is not evidence of absence, thus, where evidence is absent, the cops will either take out action without looking for evidence, because those corrupt bastards are never held to account, either that, or they make up some fake evidence using the real evidence from Microsoft Recall, so there's only one answer for Microsoft Recall, and that's to throw it the fuck out and never use Windows again, because using Windows threatens your autonomy and freedom to do as you please, no amount of VPNs, TORP, or proxies will protect you from recall either, the only human thing to do is to switch to Linux, ironic isn't it? Because earlier, I literally said that switching to Linux is not going to solve the problem of surveillance, which is definitely true, but at the same time, it's the only way to avoid being stuck in a rut, otherwise you are stuck in a rut with Windows, and God only knows if the police will use recall for the right or wrong reasons, but my guess is that the legal system can use such tools to its greatest advantage, fitting people up for crimes they never did and with actual evidence of what you were doing on the computer, the cops, judge, jury, and executioner get to decide the course of action that is appropriate, and as if Microsoft were not spying on you already through the built-in system telemetry data collection services, they were spying on you this whole time, it's just that Microsoft is taking things up a notch, and the police will absolutely love this new feature, it will allow them to be the most bent, corrupt, incompetent bastards like you have never seen before, and if Microsoft managed to fool you once, shame on them, but if this is the second time Microsoft fooled you, it's shame on you mate, fool me once, shame on you, fool me twice, shame on me, so if you were fooled again by Microsoft, shame on you for not switching to Linux. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.